the whole sermon, the text, the title, the subject that we were talking about was the church, you know, and, and being in church, staying in church, being in that place, not just in the place, but in God's presence, but making sure you're in the place because that's a place where you'll find God's presence. And um, so I closed out talking about how I played with Dan Marino. And when I hooked up with Dan, Dan and I had this play that nobody could stop. It was a timing play. I don't know why we didn't run it every every down because nobody could stop it. You know, I take off, he get up in the huddle, you know, out of the huddle, break it, get up, call the snap count. I take off running down the field about 17 yards down the field. I break to the outside, turn, and the ball was coming. It was there. Dan would hit me on the sidelines. Nobody could stop it. It was a timing play. Remember, mm -hmm. I said it was a timing play. So before I made my break, Dan had already released the ball. It was already in the air. It was already on the way. I just had to get to the right place at the right time so I could receive what Dan was throwing to me. Mm. <laughs> you feel that, James? <laughs> I just had to be there in the right place at the right time. Some of us wonder about our blessings. God has already released your blessing. God has already sent it. It's already on the way, but you got to be in the right place at the right time to receive it. Because there's some places mm. that God's not throwing blessings. Mm. God's not throwing blessings at the crack house. He's not Come throwing blessings through the whole house. He's Come not, he's not, he's not, that, no, he's not throwing blessings there, but you go to church at, God, at God's house, he'll, he'll hit you with a blessing there. He'll hit you with a blessing there. <laughs>